What's changed the most between the Bills of this year and the Bills of last year? It, of course, is the defense, and it's the front line. And I had said going into this one, hey, if the Bills are going to be able to get a win in the style in which they did against the Rams. They're going to have to prove that they can stop the run. Last year, Derrick Henry went off against the Bills. 143 yards, three scores, busted off that house call for about 75 yards. We also know Jonathan Taylor went off last year for the Colts against the Bills. The Bills had a rough time last year against the run. Last week, the Rams barely ran the ball at all. I know everybody and their mother was bitching about Cam Akers because they had him on fantasy and he barely touched the field. We didn't really get an accurate representation last week as to what we can expect from the Bills against the run. But we knew coming into this week, this would be as good of a test as ever. Doesn't get much better than Derrick Henry. Well, last night, it doesn't get much worse than Derrick Henry's career. And if you're looking at the difference between the Bills of this year and last year, it, of course, is the D-line. And this was the opportunity to see what this D-line could prove against an elite run game. Against one of the best running backs in the league. One of the best running backs in the league the last several seasons. An absolute freak specimen of a human being in Derrick Henry. Derrick Henry last night against the Buffalo Bills defense, quite literally quite literally had one of, if not the worst game in the history of his entire NFL career. Derrick Henry, 13 carries for 25 yards, 1.9 yards per carry with a long rush of nine yards. Let's put that into perspective here because everybody has a down game, right? Everybody has a bad game. Sure. We know that we've seen it. Time and time again, of course, from all the best players throughout the league, including our Bills. Last night was more than just a bad game. It was one of the worst games he has ever had. And I don't think it's a coincidence. I don't think he just had a bad night. He had a bad night because he went up against the most elite D front, one of the most elite defenses the league has seen in quite some time. This defense last year ranked number one overall throughout the NFL. But we all know it never quite felt like the Bills defense was dominant. We knew they were good, but there were plenty of games last year where they got ran over, where they didn't look like the number one defense. <laughs> last night, that not only did they look like the number one defense, but they looked like one of the best defenses we have seen in this league in some time. Let's put into perspective just how badly they shut down Derrick Henry. That was the least amount of rush yards Derrick Henry has had in a game since 2018. It is the lowest yard, or excuse me, it is tied for the lowest yards per attempt he has had in a single game since 2017. And his long rush of the game was a mere nine yards. That was the shortest rush that was considered to be his longest rush in a single game in over 30 regular season games. It's not like he got hurt. It's not like they didn't give him the ball. He just got dominated.